Hey everyone, I'm Verawak, and welcome to another game gander. Hug. Today I'll be looking at Kinga, Seeds of Civilization. I really hope I'm saying it right. I think so. That's what I'm going to call it from now on. This is a city builder roguelike game where, as a thinker, you get to go down onto, I guess, the realm of the mortal men and build, create your colony, and hopefully survive. As you progress, you do get to unlock new thinkers, like these two, uh, which you start with different starting crews, resources, different stats, and just different perks. So you get to pick and choose whichever one you want. I'm just going to start with this normal person that we start with. Um, here we have a little alcove for the encyclopedia if you have any questions, and as you play you unlock new things. So you get karma, and with that karma you get to buy things from this shop. And then it gives you access to new items and new buildings and passives in game. This is where you get quests. Here we go, we're gonna take, uh, well, take to the sea challenge. And once you select it, we go to the map and we start it. The glowing one is the, the one for the, uh, the quest. So here you get to choose where you wanna go. There's a lot of different zones you get to unlock. And the goal is right here. Once you build this, once you do this challenge, you win. There we go, going down to the realm of mortal men. So here we go, this is where we start. With this person, we have four workers. Uh, first thing to do is to build a campfire, so you can build it basically anywhere you want. One pro tip that I've learned from, from playing like the tutorial and trying one map. Uh, don't settle too close to enemies, hello. We do have these like creatures and it seems we can tame them. I need to find out how to do that. But basically these people start with a heck of a lot more units. So if you settle too close, they're probably just going to attack you and you will die. So there's the other enemy. Treat them as enemies, it's safer. Sometimes you can have like friendly trade routes, but it's safe to just assume they'll be enemies. And here we could build our campfire wherever. So I want to sort of build it sort of far away from the enemies. Um, the other, another issue I've learned, um, these snails have an acid breath and they get, they're going to destroy your, your dudes and you'll lose. So try not to settle too close to them. In terms of resources, I'm honestly not sure what is needed, but basically there's different resources. Up here you can see whatever your mouse is hovering over, it tells you what it is. Mud, clay, mud, reeds, bamboo, palm tree. Uh, well, not water. You got your, your hearth, brave. So at least if you don't know what it is, you could just hover over it and it just tells you. All right, so let's build a campfire. I might just try to build it here. At the top left here, it shows you the amount of, of resources in there, I guess. And, uh, yeah, ideally I'd like to settle here, but these these people are way too close. They have all the trees. Not very nice. Oh, I could settle up here though. It's a little close. It's a little close. All right. Well, I'm going to settle down here and see what happens. Worst comes to worst, well, I end up dying. It's not that bad. We'll start with uh How do I get up here? Okay, there's a ramp right here. Okay, that's good. That's reassuring. So let's just start out here. Hopefully I don't need much wood because there's not much. You can also pause by pressing spacebar. And here we are. You got little uh, objectives here to help you through. So we're building a campfire. Once that's done, we have our little thinker over here. And he has health. We have an inspiration. So here we have three different types of homes. If I get this one, I'm not going to have wood, so I can't do that. So I'm either going to get this embedded home or a Tiwa house. Ooh, it'd be built on top of each other. That sounds pretty neat. The sky's the limit. Oh, oh, if I can access it. All right. Um, we have clay and we have reeds. So I might just get this one because it allows our braves to excavate clay from their surroundings. So it's good against full fire protection, full wind protection, full snow protection, no rain protection. That's fine. They both have no rain protection. So let's get this one. 
the way that you get more people is with more houses, you put food in them. And there we have it. I could also build down here if I want. There we go. So go build. We can... They're going to go mine the resources that we need and build things. And we're good. So while they're doing that, this is where we get our thinker. And there's these like beams of light. And when we bring our thinker to these places, they're going to, well, think. And then we'll have new technology to select from. Go, we'll build three houses, like it says here. Our dude is thinking. So we can either have a fishing tower, crop rows, or bakery. So for the bakery, it takes reeds, gives us food. This takes reeds, gives us or food. This just gives us food. I think I'm going to take the fishing tower. Let's do that. We can build, like, we're, like, right along the, the shore, so that's really good, I think go so we just need some bamboo to build them which we have nearby and let's just send our our buddy to go look at stuff can i go up top here maybe i feel like if i get up top here they might attack me because it's too close i don't even know if i can get there where are you you can't don't attack me i'm just old man walking by please Please don't attack me. I think I'm okay. Okay. So here we have a couple of houses built. We've got a little fishing tower being built. And we're fishing, I guess. Soon we need bamboo. Got it. Choppa choppa. Got it. Yay! Uh, let's see. We can get some reeds by using clay. Do I need reeds? I don't know. So I don't know enough about what I'm going to need in the future, but based on what I have now, I can sort of better judge what I'm going to get. So let's get a reed field, I think. But there's lots of reeds here. I don't think I need a reed field. Uh, let's see. I think I'm going to produce some stone and see what happens. There we go. Every time we get to a question mark, that's when we get to research a uh, festival. There we go, this dude's fishing. Good job. All right, so where are our people? I want you. So whenever there's smoke on the houses, uh, they're working on getting more people in the colony. They take food and then we attract more people. So we can get up 12, which is good. Max out colonists. That's what that's what I say. Festival. Uh, we could beckon a snail, or we could get bamboo. I don't think we need bamboo. So I'm gonna get this snail beckon thing, um, so we can tame it and see how that goes. I feel like it's gonna go terribly wrong, but you know what? That's just part of life. I think. All right. So we have six people. It's good. Now we need to get more food. I feel like this takes a while to get food. This takes a really long while to get food. I'm going to need more fishing huts. I just don't have enough space. Okay, so we got a fish. Is that one? That is one. Oh gosh. So I need more, way more food production. All right, buddy, you can go chop down this bamboo. No, you can't. Oh, we can't get up there. Okay, well, the one good thing is I can send him on an expedition. Go cut that down. We'll send our thinker there, and you can go chop down this bamboo. No bamboo, we're getting it. Don't worry. I'm on top of things, maybe. Chop that one. So it turns out I probably should have gotten the bamboo growing one. Oh well. So my thinker is going to think of some kind of 
protection thing? An umbrella, maybe? And then I'm gonna try to get here, but I'm probably gonna get be attacked. Are there any research here? There's like a bridge thing, okay. Which we could get another food thing. So one thing I wanna get is a way to build defenses. I could go up here, I guess, but not really. Oh, this is tough. Inspiration gained. Uh, this is rain. Rain collector. Store rainwater to fight fires. Or a windmill. Push clouds away, protecting your town. That's a lot of resources that I don't have. Or a lightning totem. Ooh, lightning totem. I think I'll get a rain collector because I have clay. <laughs> Alright, Thinker. You can go over here. Hopefully you don't get attacked. If you do, I'll be a bit upset. Uh, find and tame the albino beast. Protect the beast from harm. Okay, I don't know if I can do that. So what I'll do, I think I'll claim this here so we can have more space to build our... some fishing things. There we go. You can go chop down this tree. I heard it. They are attacking me. Oh no! Bastards. Bastards. Okay. So I think I have an issue here in that I don't have... Oh gosh. My thinker is hurt. People help me. Help me. Attack them. There we go. Fight to the death. We've got weapons. There we go, one down, another one down. Right, so our banner is complete. <laughs> Have another one of these, and we'll build more houses. Oh, actually, first, build a stone thing just so we have it. Uh, let's have another one. Rain collector. I think I'll build it up here. No, I want it nearby, actually, because uh, in case there is fire... I feel like I shouldn't have fire on mud, though. I could be very wrong, but I'm hoping... Let's go get this bridge. So this bridge is going to allow us to sort of traverse areas, I think. Is someone throwing something? We need wood. You. Chop some wood. You're also doing nothing, right? Chop it. Why do I need bamboo? Oh, for my fishing thing. There's a couple of bamboo things here. No logs. We're working on it. We're working on it. I'm sending them to do stuff. Uh, inspiration gained. Huzzah! So we can have a bamboo ladder, a platform, or an overhang. I think I'm gonna get a bamboo ladder so we can climb up top here. I don't know what this thing does. No bamboo, no logs. That's okay. Rain collector built. Forgiven? My atrocities? The fact that I went to go research and then they wanted to attack me, that one, that my, that, that's my atrocities. Yeah, okay. Demand. What are you demanding, Reed? I've got plenty. There you go. Get some bamboo. Get more bamboo. So because I'm not gonna have some, some, um, well... I guess I'm not gonna have any army units, military units. I need to go up here. That's not gonna happen. What if I send my thinker there again? Is that gonna help? Maybe not. I think he's gonna get attacked. Get someone in here, get someone in here. Just so we can res or get more people, I guess. Why is no one going in there? 
Why is no one... Why are you guys not working? There we go. Just gonna sneak by. I don't know what this is. This looks pretty important, though. Oh, what is this? Watchtower. That's your town to detect enemies. Trade routes. Oh, I didn't know resources degraded in the elements. Well, today I learned. Um, I guess I can detect raids. Or, you know what? Reject all and choose a passive instead. Taming? Taming. We're going to get some taming done here. All right, so we're getting more people. We're doing stuff. I need... I need to get to this somehow. I don't think I can, though. Cannot. Oh, my thinker can go up there after. All right, well, I need to find... Is this the... This is not the albino beast. Oh, my God. It... It burns things? Don't come near my base, please. So I need to get the arena festival, so hopefully this will be it. So it's not too bad. You can avoid combat and still finish your goals. The arena. There we go. So we're gonna get more people. Research the people. We've got someone working here, right? Oh no! My houses! That rain! It's like sugar. My houses are made of sugar, I think. Oh. Oh, this flood's not good, right? Okay. Why are you not working? Oh yeah, and also whenever um, you, the more things you do, the more the ante goes up, and the harder the uh, events are gonna be. Well, thanks for you know ruining everything, you rain cloud. That's a lot of flooding. Four houses. Okay, well, lesson learned: build houses on top here. Like up there, we'll have a little climbing thing. And there as well. No bamboo, thinking at inspiration. I mean, there's nothing I can do. These dudes are... Yeah. There we go. This is going well. All I have to do is hurry up and build this, uh, this, this thing. I don't know when the floods go. Oh, the flood's going away there. And then we've got lightning. Got it. Oh, we have no bamboo. Got it. <laughs> Maybe I should pay attention to things. Get this bamboo. And get you to get this bamboo. We've got an inspiration. Access water to fight fires. Uh, let's get a passive. I like passives. Stones to your meals to keep your people from being pushed in combat or by wind. I didn't know wind Wind can push them around. Let's get hats It's gonna rain soon There we go time to fix everything 12 out of 12. Yeah, we're, we're building oh my God, Where are you going you work on this house? You work on this house. We've got wreaths everywhere. Oh, we need clay. There's clay everywhere. They're slowly working at it, I guess. I think that's all my thing can do. We can go up there. I'll build it here. All right, people. Um, get some clay. That's good. Look at us getting some clay. Oh yeah, hey you, you can get some bamboo. I think one thing that would be nice is if you could uh, mark an area for harvesting. 
instead of clicking on some people and then telling them what to do. Feels like there's something here. Can I send my thinker? What is this? It looks like pretty. Shield bearer gear. Can I take this? No, don't destroy my houses. Oh, but I, I literally just fixed them. Well, that's unfortunate. Can you extract this? No. Oh, can you do something about it? Oh, don't. Oh, God. Okay, don't walk in the fire. Please be smart about this. I don't know how to put out fire. I guess I have a rain collector. Alright. Well, you guys need to be doing stuff. Like, for example, building this thing. We need someone here. We need someone here. We need someone fishing. That's good. And this person is not really fishing. I failed to deliver? Oh. I thought it would automatically get done. I guess not. That's okay, though. That's okay. Why is no one working where I want them to work? Hey, you. You're doing nothing. Go work in this fishing hut. Are you coming to attack me? What are you doing? My thinker can't attack. Alright, get back to work now. Hop to it, lads. Go, go. One in here. We need we need 20 people in order to win. We should be able to use the bodies for like fertilizer, right? I think. Why well, you no work in here? Oh, there we go. There we go. So we're fishing. We need to get more people. Seven more people. We're working on it. You are doing nothing. You are doing building. Okay. These people are doing nothing around the campfire. It seems. I need you to get in here. Thank you. Hey. more food you can you can go like literally right in here with this food there we go there's another person so now I'm just waiting and hoping that the rain doesn't destroy my base so I can get more and more people I feel like these fishing things aren't working you want to go inside Go inside there, then. It says someone's working, but I'm not really seeing the animation. Like, they're not going up there. Get in there. Get up there. Start reproducing by yourself. Yeah, look at this. They have, like, a million colonists, and I've got, like, 14. I'm not going to send my thinker anywhere, because this is, like, definitely, definitely suicide. This is a terrible idea. That's okay, it just needs to take a little bit more time. We'll get more people. We need to get more reeds. There's reeds there. I'm not sure why we're not building. We should be able to build. Bring the reeds here, please. We need four. We need three. All right. I don't know if I have to micromanage them the whole time. But I might have to to get things done. It, there we go. Can you come also build? There's a trade route. 
I give food, they give clay. No, I've got so much clay. For you guys. Yeah, that's right. Take that and some of this. Go help, minions. Go help. Done. It is not ready. I need three more people. Look at this. Look at this nice area. We are working on getting people. Sort of close to it. Oh, this is this is easy. I'm easily gonna win for sure. The way that I play, I try to avoid combat because I hate combat. I suck at combat. What if we go try to tame a snail? You know what? Let's do a snail taming thing. We need some wood? All right, I need you to go chop some wood like this one here. Oh no, it's getting more dangerous. You know what, worst comes to worst, once I have 20, I can just do the whole the festival and be done with it. But I want to get a snail. No logs. Well, you get log. You get other log. I could tame these snails, I think. But I feel like me against two snails means death. So I'm gonna I'd rather take my chances with I think I just need one. Oh well everything's flooded. Well that's awkward. Oh no. <laughs> Well, since we're just standing around, let's just get more resources. Like, we've got so much fish this here. Yep. This uh, flood was a terrible idea. So, lesson learned. Don't build at the bottom. It might look safe, but it's not. Oh, there we go. Everything is fine. So we got some clay, all we have to do is just bring it. I think that horn means I'm under attack. Or not. Uh, we need to bring food here. Someone needs to work on this. Oh, there we go. We can hold a festival. Once the houses are built, uh, we're gonna hold a festival and it's gonna be amazing. Uh, yeah, host festival, let's go. So we're summoning, call a snail from the wild and tame it. Calling a snail. Are these gonna come over or is this gonna like appear out of nowhere? Icebreaker. Large beast has chosen this location for its migratory path. Is that a bad thing? I think so. Oh, we are taming. Oh, there's the. Oh, wait, that was a random other snail. Are you going down the. Oh, impressive. <laughs> Tamed. Oh, yeah. Right? Thinker is thinking. We're getting something. Snail tamed. This this went well. Can we tame the other ones? Can I get all of you to tame this? I don't know if this is a bad idea. I mean, it probably is. Oh gosh, I'm getting killed by acid breath. Tame the other one, because that one's also attacking us. Oh, I'm losing a lot of enemies. Uh, and by enemies, I mean units. Uh... Okay. Two passengers or items on top? Yes. 
All right, so one thing led to the next, and this is not good. This is not good. I need to get all of you to go tame this thing before I lose everything. Oh no! Oh no, I was so close to just being done! Okay, I guess on the bright side, I've got three snails now. Maybe that's worth it. Okay, well... Mistakes were made. A house fire! And we got a rain collector! Are the snails shooting acid at the fire? Are we fighting fire with acid? Are my snails killing all my dudes? I think this was a bad idea. I think these snails were a bad idea. Uh, right, okay. I do have a lot of regrets right now. A lot of them. All right, well, I mean, on the bright side, uh, I just need to get up there. I just need to re- to get more people again, I guess. Hello, snail. Well, okay. See, now that I've done this, you don't have to worry about losing all your units to snails. <laughs> Alright, well, well, I need to get over 20 braves again. I'm sure that's fine. Uh, you're fishing. That's good. We have you fishing as well, which is good. I don't like this fishing thing. I feel like it takes forever. You're doing nothing. So can you go fish in here, maybe? I feel like this is not going to work, this fishing area. I'm going to dismantle this and... This one as well. I don't really know how these work and how they don't work. I'll try one here. People are demanding things. I don't want their demands. We'll try these two and see how it goes. Bamboo, I've got six-ish. All right, 15, we got three snails. Maybe I should actually send my snails. Where's the other snail? I had three snails. Excuse me, snail. I need you all three here. We're gonna go attack this and see how this goes. Oh, hello, snail. No food. We're working on it. It's raining. Huh? I'm sure it's fine. Do we have no bamboo still? Get this bamboo. You get this bamboo here. I don't know where you're going. More bamboo. And bamboo. That means you come work on this thing. It's possible that the placement of it doesn't really work, but that's okay. All right, snails. Where's the third snail? Oh, there it is. Easy. 
Did they attack me? Are we in a good standing with them? Cautious. These dudes are our enemies. I don't know which one's the Ashiots. Are these you? I'm gonna assume so. No, snail, come back here. Oh, I need I need a rider for okay, I need to get a rider on here. So we can um go combat. So we're just gonna do a quick combat so we can see what that looks like. Get on that snail, please. No, don't chop it down. There we go, okay. whatever you want. Oh my god, are we both attacking like friends? We're just gonna attack everything, I guess. Oh. Uh, I guess my people are- okay, well, bye. Let's just have our little- <laughs> turns out that didn't go as, like, as expected, so we're just gonna leave this place. That's a lot of meat, though. That's okay. Here's our festival. Yay, everything is fine right in the world. Yeah. Oh, did I lose two people? Did they die? Did we have a sacrifice? Oh, it was an arena. Yes. It was a fight to the death, I think. To fight on. Yep. Um. Hello. I hosted the arena festival. Excuse me? You can't take this away from me. I sacrificed snails and people. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh, I need to have the festival. Can I host it in the water? Not sure. Might be a bad idea. So I'm hosting the arena festival. The thinker's here as well. The arena festival. Yay, huzzah! I don't like how I <laughs> we fight to the death here. Seems like a terrible idea. Um, how many are we going to lose? We lost two already. Three? A victor has been named. Oh, there we go. Okay. Whew. Yay, so that means I've got, uh, I've unlocked a new map. We've got one, two, three, four, five karma. And I don't like this fishing thing. We can keep, we can... Keep a technology for the future. I think I want the bamboo ladder because it's helpful getting up places. So here we go. That's how that's how you win easily. Easily. No mistakes made. Um, we've hammered 2,300 nails. We lost 36 units. That's quite a lot. At least five from the arena. We produced one brick. Wow, impressive. <laughs> Huzzah! So that means I've unlocked new things. Huh? Oh, we've unlocked a new thinker even. I don't know what it does, but I'll have to try different things. Yes, yeah, so this is Kanga. It's a very fun little game. I like this took me 37 minutes to do and I feel like I've ex extended the time. Like I did the whole combat thing, which wasn't necessary, especially because 
you know, I lost a lot of things. But it can be done between, like, every map can be done between, like, 20 to, I'll say, 60 minutes. So I really like that. I like just having a bit of time for a round and not have to remember what I have to do kind of thing. <laughs> Yeah, thank you for watching my game gander. Hold. If there's any other games you'd like me to try, let me know in the comments. Overall, this game is fun. I do think there are a few bugs. Getting the Braves to work in the fishing towers didn't quite seem to work. I don't know if it's a bug or just the placement didn't work. Maybe that's the case, but I, I'm not an expert on the placement of those. It's really a fun little game. I'm not sure how the combat works. I feel like if you don't get if you don't get your thinker close to a combat uh, research point, then you're basically screwed for combat, which doesn't seem great. Aside from hope to get as many as many colonists to overpower their military forces, which let's face it, that's not going to happen. But again, thanks for watching, everyone, and I will see you all in the next video.